tachyons. Tachyons interacts directly with the slower than light speed world through subtle organizing energy fields. These are commonly referred to as SOFs. Now SOFs contain the blueprint for perfect order. SOFs are the cosmic glue that holds all forms together. They are the matrix upon which physical and subtle bodies manifest. Tachyon is converted by the SOFs into the exact frequency needed to restore and maintain perfect balance. No matter what the form, animate or inanimate, SOF holds all energy frequencies together. If a SOF is blocked or depleted, the flow of life force energy through the energetic continuum becomes deficient. The result is a state of disharmony and imbalance. Now, this deficiency may present itself through symptoms such as pain or fatigue or even disease. Now, if a tachyonized tool is applied to the deficient area where the SOFs are blocked or depleted, it will immediately provide the SOF with all the potential to convert the exact frequency needed to restore harmony and balance. And once energetic harmony and balance are restored, the physical body normally follows and health is restored. The SOFs hold the intelligence to determine the exact frequency needed for perfect order. Now tachyon exists above light speed and an interface is needed to communicate with our slower than light world of form and tachyon. That interface is the SOF, which exists just below the speed of light. It is through the SOF that tachyon is converted into all levels of frequencies and form. SOFs are in direct communion with tachyon. SOFs convert tachyon into all levels of frequencies and form. The more tachyons are available, the more the SOFs are energized and organized. The more energized and organized our SOFs are, the healthier we are. The tachyon, therefore, is the critical factor which energizes the SOFs. So the more tachyon energy we bring into our lives, the more energized and therefore organized are our SOFs. The energizing of the SOFs is what creates health and rejuvenation because it reverses entropy, i.e. aging. Now, when tachyon energy is free-flowing, then we have an endless source of energy to rebuild and maintain our SOFs, and we continually reverse entropy. As a result, the body-mind complex becomes more clear and balanced in its spiritual evolution. It also becomes an increasingly better transducer and conductor of energy. As this happens, the body is able to experience greater amounts of this higher energy. SOFs have both form and energy. They can hold, gain, lose, resonate with, transduce, and transmit energy. Tachyon energy energizes the SOFs and therefore reverses entropy and aging. So what do we need to do now? We need to charge them SOFs.